right, well, it's day one of the One Bass Arizona Open out here on cold and windy and tough Lake Havasu. I'm um, about 122, I weigh in at 430. I'm just waiting for my co-angler to come um, over to the dock after parking the truck and everything. Um, looking uh, at a tough day today, it's gonna be a grind. Um, it, I'd love to come in with five fish. I think it's gonna be tough. I think a lot of guys are gonna have a tough day out here on the water, the bites just shut down out here. Um, but when you do get bites, they are quality fish. So hopefully we can uh, bring in five of those and get a good start off to the tournament. The next couple days of the tournament should be a little bit better in terms of, of bites, but you know, 172 boats in this tournament, there's a lot of pressure out on the lake. So hopefully we can get the job done today and then move on to day two in a good spot. So follow along, let's see how the day goes. Number one, not a giant, but we'll take it. We got one. Hard fast. Sorry about him, we're back in the two shot. Yeah, we don't, we can't afford that, no. but we didn't, so whatever. Uh, the fish that are being caught are good ones. We, um, I mean, I'll take it. If we could figure out a way to scrounge up five fish, I'd be so pumped up. Stop talking into this, huh? <laughs> Two point three one pounds. Open up that bag for him. 
Thanks, take that over the release boat for us. Thanks, Matt. All right, next up we've got... Well, day one did not go as planned or as we would have hoped, and um, it was brutal out there. The wind was crazy again today. It was cold. You know, for us out here in the desert, normally it's like in the 70s right now. Um, when I got here, it was in the 70s, and when I leave, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be in the 70s. But this cold snap has just really made things difficult. It's, it really shut down the fishing for me. Um, as in any tournament, guys caught them. I mean, there were 20-plus pound bags caught today. Um, I don't know what those guys are doing. I'm not around those fish by any means. But the crazy thing is with how bad today went and how much of a hole I dug myself, I still have a chance to catch a, a cash a check in this tournament. If I can figure out a way to catch a limit tomorrow and the third day, there's a good likelihood that I could still come out of this tournament with a check. Um, you know, I got a lot of ground to make up. I got a lot to figure out. I mean, literally, we got probably three bites on the boat all day today. I had one fish that I caught. I had one short strike on a jig, and then my co-angler had one that he said he missed on a drop shot, and um, that was it. We had three bites for the entire day. Um, the weather should change a lot tomorrow. Um, it's not supposed to blow like it has been the last three days, um, so I'm going to have to adjust to that and have to you know, change my techniques up. I got a game plan for the morning. I think I'm going to throw um, some swim baits and stuff like that. Hopefully get a couple big bites in the morning if I'm lucky. And then after that, we're just going to have to kind of fly by the seat of our pants and just see the way the weather develops and just fish the conditions and just try to cover water and um, fish differently and in fish different areas. Because obviously, you know, I must not be around them or else um, I think I would have gotten more bites. So um, day two is tomorrow. Gonna go out, fish hard again tomorrow, and um, hopefully, you know, have a better bag. You know, there's only room for improvement. You know, you know that's that's the game that I'm playing. Is I'm just trying to improve tournament after tournament, day after day, and um, tomorrow I'm just looking to improve. So I hope you enjoyed today's video. I know there wasn't a lot of fish catches, but that's just the way it goes sometimes. So if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up, um, share it with somebody, and subscribe to my channel, and leave me a comment down below. Thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you guys tomorrow.